Hi, I'm Will Morris, a design and development engineer at HD. In this video, I'll share some tips and tricks about how to self-check engineering drawings. Until the future arrives, where engineering drawings are a thing of the past and everything is captured in the CAD model data, engineering drawings are still an integral factor in the design and manufacture of components. A first-class drawing will speed up the process of manufacture and allow features to be checked efficiently to ensure quality is maintained throughout the life of a product. The typical self-check tools and processes for engineering drawings are as follows. An on-screen check, which is a lightweight review to identify obvious issues or deficiencies. A 2D drawing checklist, which is a general list of features which must be on a drawing. A PDF output check, a printing check, and an Adobe DC check. Checking the drawing as you're drafting is the best way to capture any mistakes and implement corrective action before it's released for formal checking. Simple things like ensuring all overall dimensions are shown and aligned to the correct features is easy to do, but it's the most common ones to cause an issue. However, it's recommended not to get too held up ensuring the drawing looks perfect and to focus on the essential requirements of the design intent. Tidying it up can come later if required. Creating a 2D drawing checklist for your company is strongly recommended. It helps new starters prepare new drawings to the appropriate standard before involving a formal check. We recommend different checklists to suit concept, prototype and volume level drawings. The checklist should reflect the processes being used and the risks around incorrect or missing data. A drawing supporting a 3D model for rapid prototyping purposes is much lighter than the one controlling a medical device or an aerospace component. Exporting drawings from your drafting program to a PDF format can introduce new risks and create export errors in the process. Always check that the PDF output matches your on-screen drawing, as this is ultimately the drawing that will be approved for release. Having a combined PDF is great for spotting things like issue numbers, rev levels, general notes, and drawing numbers by quickly scrolling through. Printers are magical tools. You can do lots of screen checks, but the second they print out a seemingly perfect drawing shows errors like a beacon of light. It would be great to avoid paper printing, but for some reason, an old-fashioned print can often flush out something which a screen check just can't do. When producing a complex drawing that is produced on a large border, a decent compromise is to use an A3 size, as it can be incredibly difficult to spot A1 size drawing errors on an A4 page. Adobe DC is a useful digital tool to have in your inventory. Digital comments can be added to engineering drawings, highlighting dimensions or notes, and corrective comments can be typed up next to them. These can be quickly emailed across the studio to drawing checkers to review and approve. Another key feature in DC is the PDF Compare tool. This allows you to compare two similar drawings and can highlight the areas of difference, verifying that only the expected changes have been made. Using existing software to check your output can save many hours of work and ultimately reduce the risk of errors or missed deadlines. These many techniques of self-checking work are only a piece in the puzzle of verification and validation of the design output. However, it's good practice to incorporate into your everyday design workflow.